This is a Microvision update. Stock ticker MVIS. Microvision is an automotive and industrial LiDAR manufacturer. And also, oddly, one of the key technologies inside the IVIS weapons system helmets that literally turn US soldiers into Halo guys. But more on that later. Publicly, they're focused on automotive LiDAR Maven N. And more presently, on the cheaper, shorter range version of their LiDAR, the Movia L, which will go into forklifts and agricultural equipment. There's evidently enough dudes running over other dudes in warehouses that that's a big market. And obviously, self-driving tractors can, I don't know, make straighter lines or replace the last remaining farm workers. So we can attempt to fight against how expensive food is about to get because of all of those other dumb reasons. Back in December, Dangman and I talked about how Sumit and the boys told us they were increasing the production capacity of their Movia L sensor, the one for the industrial stuff, but also presumably for like lane changes and self-parking services for cars and trucks. Microvision stated, and I quote, that they expect output of Movia L sensors for 2025 to significantly increase compared to 2024. I don't think we have the number of units output in 2024, or at least I couldn't find that. And you're no help, ChatGPT. Just kidding, you're an amazing research partner and I value your input. Investors.com says that Microvision plans to pump out between 10,000 and 30,000 Movia L units in 2025. I don't know where they got those figures and I do actually have a direct line to investor relations Jeff Christensen. Hey Jeff. And he, well, he didn't get back to me fast enough before I shot this. So who knows if that's true. We don't even know what they cost per unit yet anyway. Then in February, we got another announcement from Redmond that Microvision had renegotiated their terms on the $75 million convertible note from High Trail Capital. They also said they raised $17 million of new capital. If I get this right, that means that $8 million was raised by selling new shares at a 12.5 discount to the market rate. And then an additional $9 million was issued as stock warrants, which gives High Trail a five-year option to buy the stock at a buck 57, which means if the price goes up significantly, those warrants will be exercised and become even more shares. So yes, dilution, but also runway. And it's looking more and more as the months and years drag on that this fucking spruce goose needed a lot of runway to take off. But keep holding, there's a lot of tar left and just maybe Palmer Lucky is reaching for the button that's marked Operation Credible Sport. Might have to Google that one. That said, Microvision remains active in seven automotive RFQs, meaning we're in the fight for seven major automotive manufacturers or OEMs to make the LiDARs for their cars. And in the meantime, we plan to gain enough speed for liftoff by hucking the smaller sensors in the industrial sector. Aren't we, Devin? And I'm sorry I got you in trouble at CES two years ago, but like, it's about time now, right? And finally, this guy. I know Mr. Lucky posting in the subreddit was pretty wild, and no doubt it might mean his new company, Anduril, which has said publicly that it plans to eat up smaller companies that are involved in autonomous navigation, and is also taking over the IVIS goggles that almost certainly contain Microvision's Miracle Engine, laser beam scanning module, and has also said that he believes in the tech, and that Microvision was one of the first three stocks that he ever bought, is gonna swoop in and either light the fire leading to the squeeze, or outright buy the company and send us to wherever our actual shareholder value belongs. Dang. It's equally plausible that he was drunk doom scrolling on Reddit and decided he wanted to see a bunch of reply red dots on his app, so he popped in to say hello. Whatever the path this company will take, I've committed to holding till at least 2030 before I lose any hope at all. Also, however long this video ended up being, just know that Dangman had to pull me around this floor for much longer than that due to how the process of me talking out loud actually sounds compared to what it looks like on the internet. And lastly, I fed the entire website of Anduril and all of Mr. Lucky's posts into a chat GPT, and then I fed the last couple of earnings statements from Microvision in also and had them make me a flowchart about the partnership that may exist between us. Right now, Microvision stock is at, what is that? $1.45, so if you ask me, we're at this phase here. Thank you, goodbye. This would be kind of nice just to do regular work. Microvision is an automotive and industrial. Ooh.